Let us look at integral of x plus 3 divided by x squared plus 6x whole thing squared versus integral of x plus 3 times x squared plus 6x to the power of square. They are kind of similar. The only difference is one is a division, the other one is multiplication. Okay, so everything is the same. We are going to do this in a second way. Let's look at the first integral. The first integral, we are going to write this yellowing uh, thingy as derivative of x squared plus 6x. The derivative of x squared is 2x plus 6. Half of that will be x plus 3. So basically this is the same thing as that. Half constant out of the integral and then you're left with this and dx squared plus 6x. Uh, 6x. Now this is a simple integral. Integral y is to the power minus 2. dy is y. Minus 2 plus 1 over minus 2 plus 1 where y is x squared plus 6x. Minus 2 plus 1 is minus 1 upstairs, minus 1 downstairs. Minus 1 times half equals minus half and then this is x squared plus 6x to the power minus 1. Write that as 1 over x squared plus 6x. Let's look at the second one. The second one we have a product, remember? Now pull, do the same, push the yellow thingy into the yellow thingy. You get the x squared plus 6x. The derivative of this is 2x plus 6. Half of that will be 3, x plus 3 dx. So the yellow thingy is the same thing as this. Half out of the... Oh, there's a typo. Forgot to move that half. Guys, there's a half here. huh? Half, move out. Now the integral of this is x squared plus 6x. 2 plus 1 over 2 plus 1. Remember, there's a half here. Forgot to add this half out. Half. There's a half times this piece. huh? Half out, half times this piece. Half times that. So uh, 2 plus 1 is 3 upstairs, 3 downstairs. So it will be half plus 1 third is 1 6. This is 1 over 6. Uh, 1 over 6, not 1 third, nah, because that's a half here. X1 plus 6x to the power 3. Done. Done. Thank you for watching. Hope video is informative, helpful. Before you go, make sure to subscribe, share, comment. And don't forget to hit or smash the like button. See you.